always forget that this likes to start right away. Anyway. Boom. Oh. That doesn't look half bad either. What is up, everybody? It's the Digital Dragon. Uh, I did not settle on that one for once. How's everybody doing? Um. It is like. What time is it? I only have this for anything right now. It's 12 o'clock at night. Pretty much. So... Guess the question is, how's everyone's night? Slash morning. Slash afternoon. Slash fiesta. Uh, how's that going? Hope it's going good. Um... I just got done with work. Not too long ago, went out, had some fun, bought a few things, some rings, gotta figure out how I'm gonna set this up, ring-wise, because, yikes, now I need like one more ring, one ring to rule them, okay, I'm done with that joke, I don't know, it's weird, they, none of them fit, but yet they all fit. But now I got, like, little brass knuckles, and it's kind of cool. Um, my hair is a mess, and in knots, and it hurts. But that is okay. Um, I deleted all of my old, uh, recording stuff, so now I have quote-unquote unlimited space. I don't know why I said quote-unquote if I was going to do the quotation marks. Um, but yeah. Uh, I deleted a lot of old videos and pictures that I didn't need, didn't look at, didn't really necessarily remember or care about. Um, so I just got done doing all that. Um, I'm gonna be doing this for a bit because it feels mass. Oh. Sorry, I'm a little tired, a little... I was going to say dyslexic, but that's not the correct word at all. I'm, I'm, I'm dizzy, to say the most. I feel a little all over the place. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, that was nasty. So where was I last video? I remember I talked about the airsoft field, I remember I talked about Tolo, which again I'm pretty sure I talked about in another video, but I never looked because I'm lazy. Um, I know I talked about something else, but I can't remember, I believe it was the shield and the new weapon attachments and all that fun stuff. Oh, I've got a fun... No. Yes, I have a fun memory, to say the least. Um, let's do this for effect. Oh my god, that... Oh, my hair. It needs to be fixed so bad. <laughs> oh, I don't know, I think I need to get it cut. Ow! I don't need my tangles. So, ah, cut. This is, this is what I do in my spare time. Like I said, I'm super fucking tired. I don't know what the I'm doing. I'm gonna stand. Get the blood flowing a bit. My chair won't move back. Fuck you. Alrighty, that actually feels a little bit better. What was I talking about? Oh. So I went um sand duning. Not sure if that's the right term. I'm actually positive it's not. Uh anyway. Uh, we went to, like, Moses Lake, whatever, a few hours away. Ah, uh, guess what? I almost died again. If anyone remembers the 4x4 Rhino story that I talked about, and I don't know what vlog, and I'm too lazy to go back into one of my more than 30 videos to go look for when I talked about the 4x4 Rhino incident. I'll give you a short and sweet version. Uh, fell out of a 4x4 rhino, 
more rather hopped out by accident because of a bump. Uh, right foot slammed into the tire, pushed me down, grinded the back of my skull against gravel, going 30, maybe 40 miles down a mountain, might I add. Um, again, without a helmet, because, you know, I was a smart child. Um, what else happened? Oh, yeah. Skull grinded across the gravel, fell into a ditch, into sticker bushes, almost sliding down that kind of a slope in a mountain, losing my left boot, fracturing my left foot. Anyway, this one's a little more, shall I say, fun. Um, I almost did a front flip. I mean, the quad did a front fr fr a front flip. I did a 180 face plant into the sand kind of flip. But I mean, hey, the quad was semi. I semi. Uh, let's see here. So. It's kind of, so, if you've gone sand duning, because that was my first time, not driving any, like, the 4x4s, the quads, any of it, the motorcycles, any of it, I've done that before. I've never gone to Moses Lake, to Guy's private property, to go sand duning, whereas it is normally farmland, which is pretty insane. Also, I'm trying to keep it down, because again, it is like 12... 12, 10 at night. Um, let's see. Yeah, no, but I've done that before. I've driven the equipment. I've fixed some of it. Was that a sneeze? That was a sneeze. Holy shit. Anyway, I'm sidetracking again. Um, you know, we've done all that stuff before, right? So, when you're sand duning, or I don't know what it's called, I'm just going to go with sand duning. If you guys know the better term or correct term, tell me. Please, tell me. I need to know. I'm too lazy to look it up, so I'll just look at the comments. Anyway, continuing on. Um, You have to look left and right, make sure nobody's coming across, because every person on a motorcycle, except for us, had no like bright neon green orange flag or orange flag like just a bright neon flag or lights or anything especially at night you can just hear the that was so accurate that i don't even need to try and describe it anymore you guys already know beautiful whatever a dirt bike sounds like anyway you could only really hear them so we're i'm looking around left right Go in, I think I'm in like, what, fourth gear on the quad? Um, I'm looking around, I'm not paying attention. Yeah, I probably should have been paying attention dead ahead instead of left and right. I never got hit by anything. There was no one around me, but I kept hearing just engine noises, right? So I'm going in fourth gear, and there's this huge, like, just a Downslide or whatever I'm trying to think of because I couldn't think of it fast enough to make it. Basically, it was a drop. So you remember remember that hill that was like this ish? Yeah, that drop was more like this. Anyway, I went straight down. Right? Yeah, I went straight down. Um. So instead of slowing down. I just tilted. While I'm floating in the air, I just tilted. The front wheels bounce off. I fall off face plant. The quad rolls off of my back from my head, pushing my skull into the ground. I had a helmet this time, though, so we're good on that. Pushing my skull into the ground, bounced off my head, and landed on all fours. I look up for half a second. I'm like, what in the f did I just do? What in the f did I just accomplish? I accomplished nothing. I almost got a right in the back of the skull, if you know what I'm saying. Anyway, um, so that happened, and I tried to get it started. Perfect. 
started up the first time. Anyway, started up the first time, right? Suddenly, I'm going fourth gear again. Like, I just got up, there was like, maybe a cut going completely down my leg, one more just, like someone took a 50 cal or something like that into my leg. It was just the surface though, barely any bone showed. I'm skinny, so that's why I'm saying barely. Anyway. There was just, like, cuts and bruises, but there was nothing major. I just got right back up and was like, you know what? I think I'm done for right now. Come back in about an hour. Started up first time, beautiful, back and forth gear, going down the freaking way, because I have, like, another five, ten minute um, ride until I get back to the trailer. Um, guess what? I hit another dip. It wasn't like this. It was more like that. I just wasn't ready for it, and I let go of the thing, and I fell off, because my legs were shaking from the first impact, and my hands were so, like, just, they were already tensed, they were shaking themselves, and there were just cuts and bruises on them, I was like, god fucking damn it, I just gave up and fell off, I was like, screw it. <laughs> um, so there's a little safety thing where that would automatically shut off, right? Um, couldn't get it started again, so I had to either A, call somebody and wait to see what happened, or B, see if I could fix it, so I didn't get yelled at. I didn't get yelled at in the first place, it wasn't really my fault. I guess the, oh, well, excuse me, the coil or whatever was already kind of going out. And it should have gone out a long time ago. I guess I just finished it off. Um, anyway. <sighs> beautiful. My hair's beautiful again. Anyway, sorry. Side trip. Um. So the coil was already going out. I just finished it off, pretty much. Well, it started up the first time, so when I fell off... I don't understand why it just shut off. I thought it was maybe, okay, might have overheated. Wait five minutes, maybe. Um, let's see. I did that. That was uh, fun. So I just kind of waited for five minutes, tried starting it again. Nothing. Not even, like, it attempting to start. Just empty clicks. Uh, so I look at the little, all the wiring and all the insides of it and I'm just thinking there's nothing here that really looks broken nothing fell out no unplugs no wire cuts no nothing that could possibly maybe have it stopped thought maybe battery could be out of juice i thought actually it can't be battery because it's a gas it's a gas quad it takes gas I'm trying to think of words oh so I thought, maybe it's low on fuel. Check the fuel thing. Nope. Like, almost a full tank. Well, maybe not a full tank. Maybe half. About. I'd say about half. Anyway. Um. So it wasn't the fuel. Wasn't any of the wiring. Wasn't any of the internal stuff. So I thought, eh, it could have just overheated. That's when I waited five minutes. Nothing happened. So I was just sitting there checking my legs, like, okay, I can still walk at least, so if I have to, I can just leave it here. Oh yeah, so remember those flags I was talking about? I forgot, I forgot to mention this. I had to carry it like a joust, like a jouster. Just one, one hand on the, on the thing, my fist on the other. It was like super hard. To, so that actually might also be why I gave up. It says trying to hold on to your life before falling off again. The flag broke, which is my only indication that, hey, you know, I'm kind of out here kind of thinking, don't fucking hit me, <laughs> you pussy bitch. Um, no, but, for real, like,
good to know that it's rock. Um, sorry, I'm sidetracking. I'm tired. I know. I want to finish the story. The flag was broken. Quad wasn't working. Couldn't start. So this guy decides to come down. Say hi, what's up? If I needed help, said probably the thing's not starting. I don't know what's wrong with it. Uh, I thought it was this, it wasn't that, but maybe it was this. And he just started helping, kind of messing with the fuel gauge and all that fun yeah. stuff. Fuel gauge, the the rubber thing that like <sighs> I don't know what to call it. I know it has a good term. I'm gonna call it the gas hose because it pumps all the gas to actually make the vehicle go. So, the gas tube, whatever, the gas pipe, I don't know, don't get a hammer me, shoot. Anyway, we're just checking that, kind of messing around with things, couldn't figure out what was wrong, it wasn't, just wasn't starting, and again, we didn't know, even after looking at it, we didn't know that it was the coil, is that what it was called, god damn it, what did I call it, yeah, coil. Um, so it wasn't what the problem was that we thought it was. If that makes sense, and it doesn't because I forgot. It. Anyway, um, we didn't know what it was. So I was like, uh, do you just want me to tell you back to you, um, to trailer? I think it was a trailer, technically. It's like a mobile home. The sand tie, it's like a little mini base for quads and you know, just... It's a thing. It's a thing. I don't know. Okay? Anyway. So, he grabbed a couple bungee cords and a chain. <laughs> the whole way there, I was in neutral. I wasn't in gear. So, him pulling me, I was just drag like... <laughs> it was the funniest ever. Um, I can When you have a helmet on with, um, well, with a bandana, like, just all over your ears, you can't really understand or hear someone. It just seems very muffled. You know they're talking because you can hear them making noise, but you don't know what they're saying. So evidently he was telling me, if, or asking me if I was in gear that entire trip. Um, I said, just didn't say anything, I just gave him a thumbs up. I was like, yeah, keep going, you're doing good. <laughs> I didn't know what he was saying, I just heard noises. I'm like, yeah, you're good, just keep her going. Anyway. So, ten minutes later, just about, around up somewhere around there, um, we make it back to a little campsite or whatever the fuck it is, the trailer, um, and we get there, right? Um, people thought I died. Uh, a few search, par search parties went out and looked for me, um, there are like two or three people uh, and the trailer, uh, uh, yeah, that's pretty much the story. How I did a front flip on a quad. There's, uh, very big extended moments in there, if you know what I'm saying. Um, kitty kitty kitty, kitty kitty kitty. Oh. I have news on the, um, kind of gaming side of my YouTube channel, and I'm not making multiple channels because it's bad. So my computer is, we'll say it's fixed. I found a few bugs with what I was trying to do, like recording uh, Civilization for Minecraft, a few guys have attempted to watch it, you'd notice 
immediately that I was talking with no skips, but the game was like, boom. Boom. Sud suddenly, like, three seconds of the video, then you're 20 seconds into the next frame. It's like, the... What? I'm so con you're just so confused, right? I fixed that. I hope. I haven't tested it. So it might not be, but... I just did kind of a factory reset. Kind of. It just didn't delete everything, and it's not like a normal reset. It's supposed to debug everything. So it's like... I, um, I want to say like it's a security measure, but that's not the word I'm looking for. It's like... Um, virus cleaner or whatever. I, I don't know what I'm trying to think of right now, and I'm really... Yeah, my brain hurts. It physically hurts, and I'm not joking about that. Anyway. <sighs> I don't understand. I've seen YouTubers do, like, 3 a.m. challenges. I've seen people try like overnights at I don't know in Costco done overnights in abandoned places watch ghost hunt. I don't know how people stay up this late even if they're like they can do an intro at like 9 p.m. let's go with 9 p.m. just because I think but then, they have to stay up until, like, 2.50 a.m. I guess they could take a nap between then. But then it'd be like, um... Their, their brain would be like mine. It'd be just waking up, like, it's super slow to think of stuff. It's super... Just kind of... Retarded. And retarded just means your brain isn't... Um... Functioning properly. Right? I need to relook that up, so let me take that, um... Analogy out real quick. I'm not editing this, I'm just gonna say we're taking that out. There's, there's my way around it. Um... Anyway... Anyway, um, I think I talked about Pixelbit. That's right, that was the thing I talked about last video, Pixelbit. Um, news on a different friend. It's kind of going to be the same thing, being quiet, I guess. They're not really talking to me as much anymore. Actually, they're not talking to anyone as much. She's still there, but she's not chatty, if you know what I'm saying. I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I think she's just getting sick of my shit. Sick of my shit. I could be wrong, though. Um, uh, if you guys want to know a cool little quote-unquote secret. Sorry, I'm trying to get... God! Miss it this time. Um, what was I going to say? What was I talking about? Why am I talking about it? And why am I here right now? I don't know any of those answers to any of those questions. So, on that note, unless I think of something in the next 10 seconds. Mm hmm. Nope, nothing. Alright. 
on that note. Sorry, I'm hearing noises. I will talk to you all in the next vlog. Um, I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. And if you don't, well, please have one. Have one someday. Relax a little. Live a little. Take chances. Do what you can to just make life worth living. Because if you don't, then why? Don't waste it. Just do what you want to do. If you've done everything you wanted to do, do the same thing I'm doing. Encourage others to do what they want to do. Give them things to try, even if they don't like them. Alright, that's my message of the day. Peace, everybody.